it's been a while, like a month. I don't even know. I've lost track of time because of school. I mean, it's not really an excuse, but that's basically it. See, I've been gone since my last vlog, which has been a while. A lot of things have happened, uh, of which I got a job at American Apparel and Urban Outfitters because it's not like I had a life. So on top of the hospital job, um, I think I've talked about that before in blog posts. If you my blog, you already know. I work at two hospitals and now I work at two stores. That's only four jobs and I'm a full-time student. Party! No, I don't have a social life anyway, so that's cool. That's cool. Anyways, so uh, today I will be vlogging. Yes, you can tell because this is the video. I don't think anyone's watching this. I'm so sad. It's Friday night. I'm just sitting here in my tiger hat. This is my life video uh, about uh, fall um, outfits because yes, we are in fall. Some people really kind of like mini skirts, especially someone as short as me and you're kind of disproportionate that, that you feel taller or you like feel like you look taller, uh, which is true. So uh, that's a good thing, I guess. <laughs> Anyways, so I wear a lot of skirts in the fall and I kind of wanted to make it weather appropriate because obviously you don't want to look like you're too summery, uh, but you are wearing a short skirt. So obviously tights are um, essential. Yes, they are. Um, at the same time, I'm just going to note that I have runs in all my tights. I don't know why this is. I buy like dollar store tights, that's probably why. They're like a dollar fifty. And the thing is, is that I always buy dollar store tights because I always have runs in my tights and I don't want to get runs in like my good American apparel tights. But then I feel like if I had American apparel tights, I wouldn't be getting runs in them as often. So it's kind of a vicious cycle. So yes, I will be wearing skirts in various autumn outfits and I hope you like them. So I'm just gonna get to it. Hey, so you made it to the first outfit, cool. Um, this is my gothic look with um, a borrowed quilted biker jacket that's leather, uh, Topshop tights with little pearls in them just to add kind of like a girly-ish edge. Um, the skirt in this one is actually a wrap dress from American Apparel with my uh, Grimes t-shirt on top of it. Um, I saw her play at Pop Montreal. And on days that I'm feeling goth, of course, I am always wearing a beanie. And I just kind of like this rough and tumble look. And I added uh, black leather wedges to kind of make it, I guess, a bit more girly with the tights. So in the second look, um, I called it wolf pack because I guess because of the shirt. It has a wolf on it. It's my sweater crop top. And I'm wearing a wool skirt from H&M. It's actually a wool blend, but because I'm wearing it on top of my sweater tights, unfortunately you can't really see. But if you check the blog post, I'll definitely make sure you're able to tell the difference. And I kind of just stepped on Abby there. Um, I'm wearing my American Apparel chiffon headband on top and um, my gray Urban Outfitters knitted sweater, which is super comfortable and it goes really well. Kind of like brings out the wolf in my shirt which is cool. I'm wearing the same sh shoes that I'm wearing in my first outfit because I think that these shoes are just very folly and they go so great with tights and skirts because they just crazy elongate your legs. So I think that this is one of my most wearable outfits. This is usually how I dress. Um, this is tights from Topshop. And it looks like I have hearts drawn on my legs because the upper part of the tight is actually nude colored. And I'm wearing it with my American Apparel interlock black mini skirt and a thrifted knitted sweater. And it's navy blue, but there's like speckles of color in it, which I really, really love. And also I love the look of over the knee socks uh, because they kind of elongate your legs. And because these are tight, it's kind of warmer and it gives this cool pattern on the upper top on the upper part of it. Unfortunately, I got a run in them though, so I'm kind of sad. And finally, this actually outfit I've worn at least like three times this semester. Um, again, my great cardigan with my Sweet Death Russian vodka shirt and my Topshop triangle necklace, which just makes me feel really gangster along with the um, you know, pointed headband. Um, this skirt's from Topshop, it's Lycra, and wearing regular sheer tights. 
and I just kind of like the gold tone jewelry and the black and the gray and it's just kind of these weird neutral mixes. Four mini skirt e mini skirt. I don't like that term, but anyway, mini skirt ish looking uh, looks for the fall. For those of you who are more vertically challenged or not, if people just want to make it look like they have long limbs, then more power to you. If you liked this video, then you should check out the main blog, which is linked below in the description bar, but I will also put it at the bottom here, which is www.maquettex.com. page. I currently have 19 likes. It was unpublished before, so if you try to like before, try again now because I unpublished it for a while just so I can kind of gather myself and stop crying about the fact that I only have 19 likes. Because it's okay for your page to only have 19 likes if it doesn't exist. Anyways. Um, also, you can reach me on Instagram and Twitter. It's at Megs M E G Z S C. And uh, I am pretty active on Facebook, uh, on Twitter and Instagram because I just love to talk about how much I hate myself on Twitter. It has caused some alarm. Um, so yes, definitely check out the blog because after a few days of this video being released, I enroll kind of like posts on each individual outfit so you can get more details on it and also more thoughts because like a one minute voiceover doesn't allow me much time to talk about my clothes and I love to talk about my clothes. Anyways, okay, I'm just laughing. Joke, so I hope you all stay safe. Have fun.